What up, man? It's your homeboy, Camp Quarter Banks, and yes, we are back at it again. Now, today we're talking about the essential pieces that just released for the winter season. Big shout out to the homie Locust and Wild Honey because he actually got the scoop on this before anybody could actually get the scoop out. So all the reviews that you see, he was the one that actually let you know that this release was coming this week. Although a lot of people were saying that this was dated to drop on Friday, it actually dropped on Thursday. That's a good reason for you to actually subscribe to the newsletter. Whenever he has these drops, he lets you know ahead of time. You actually get the information a day ahead of time now actually this essentials release is perfect it's right on time because you had so many people that was pissed off about fear god and adidas collaborating and they were saying oh this costs too much and everything like that so this is the perfect time for you to actually get your pieces now from essential because if you was one of those people that was just so mad about how this release had came for adidas and fear god you actually got essential so go ahead and get these pieces right now good part about this is jerry lorenzo has pieces that are similar to what's going on with the adidas and fear god collaboration you have the football team you had a heavy jersey tee which i was a fan of i was happy to be able to get so like i said you do have pieces that are similar and you get it for a lower price it's not going to be as great of quality as it is with fear of god and adidas collaboration but at the same time you will still have pieces that are good enough that has some decent quality when it comes to having a fashionable piece when it comes to the pricing it's as simple as this if you're getting something that's simple and basic it's like a t-shirt it's like 45 dollars, 75 dollars for like hoodies and things like that the higher in style that these pieces go the more expensive it starts to get you'll see like these three quarter zip pieces you'll see mock neck pieces you'll see these heavy hoodies that he have and they start to get up in that two three hundred dollar price it's as simple as the more stylish that these pieces get the more that the prices rise the more simple and essential that these are the more basic and simple the pricing is it's as simple as that so for those people that's like these pieces are too expensive or they getting too high in prices maybe you should start thinking of another brand to actually be excited for maybe fear of god is not for you and maybe essential isn't for you or maybe you should just save it's okay these pieces are not selling out that fast speaking of selling out i don't want nobody to get to this point no more where they like oh this should have sold out or this ain't sold out it's kind of damned if i do damned if i don't type of thing if you sell out too fast people are pissed off because they can't get the pieces because they wanted it so bad and they sold out and if it hasn't sold out people are like yo this did horrible this failed and it's really not that look if it sold out it sold out because you couldn't buy it at the time it was a real popular piece it's as simple as that but when it's having sold out it doesn't mean that it flopped actually it just means that it's a slow burn this means you got more time to buy the pieces that you want and if you don't want it why are you complaining about it it's as simple as that fun fact about this collection that he dropped is that he have some outstanding colorways so he got things like garden yellow mint dark heather gray and then you have the ink color I think all colors are actually dope that he had chose because I'm a fan of these bright colors that he actually grabbing. But at the same time, we know that it's not an essential thing for you to have like bright colors. That's not an essential thing to have bright and wild colors. It's not essential. But at the same time, for you to grab something like this and have a basic tee or basic shorts, it's perfectly fine. Now he does have pieces that's all pretty much the same. You know, you get your sweatpants, sweatshirts, tank tops, hoodies, and things like that. That's all given. But if you're really trying to dig into his crate and see what he got with this stylish piece, I will have to say he has some fire creations. First piece that I'm excited for is the crinkle nylon sweatpants, which I feel like Nike dropped the ball when it comes to this. These should have been released a long time ago, but Jerry Lorenzo actually got to it and actually hyped it up. I'm pretty sure it's a lot of people that's gonna go for this. I feel like these will sell out, and if not, it's a perfect time for you to go ahead and grab these because I'm telling you now, this is gonna be a fire piece. Hopefully he have a lot of insulation in there because it's cold right now. So having something that's nylon probably won't be too good of an idea. But if it is, flex. Next piece that I think is fire is a nylon fleece hooded sweater. I think that's a fire idea. It reminds me of the old days when they used to stuff the sweatshirt up under the t-shirt when they used to work out in the gym and everything like that old school type of vibe but i don't think it's worth 235 but i mean like it's a creative idea the other piece that caught my eye is something that you could wear during work going out or if you have a night out on the town or something like that it's the raw neck sweater and then you have the turtleneck now those going for like 100 120 or something like this but this right here is a creative idea when it comes to the raw neck sweatshirt i think this is going to be something that i would want to go for also, you had a turtleneck. I don't think that will be something that I go for, 
but it's actually pretty creative, especially with has design and everything. And yes, it is oversized, but this is perfect for you when you want to be a little bit more stylish and you don't want to wear too much of crazy colors, but you want to stand out just a little bit and you want to show you got a little flex. This is something that will show casualness. This can be very stylish for you all by wearing a simple ink color. And then again, you have pieces like your car coat, your half neck fleece, and you have multiple sweaters, tank tops, shorts, and everything like that. And he have some essential hats as well. Now I'm not gonna get into that because it's not something that I'll go for, but if you want to, hey, the creative ideas, go ahead and grab them. Now all in all, I think this is more of a fun release for the winner, but I just don't think that he went too, too serious or too deep into these pieces. I think it was just something simple for the winter time, something for you to have have fun with something for you to be stylish with sweet straight to the point now i got my pieces hopefully you got yours i'll let y'all know how they look and i'm gonna style those pieces once i get them of course i'm gonna show y'all a real review how they look when i get these joints but in the meantime between time drop those comments down below let me know do you think this is a good idea do you think it's worth the pricing that he got he got some like i said they're ranging from $45 all the way to $235 so do you think these pieces are even worth it drop those comments down below and let me know what's up I'll catch up with y'all next time. Y'all already know the vibes. I'm your homeboy, Cam Quarter Banks. I'm out. I'm gone. I'll holla at y'all. Peace.